everybody. How's everybody doing? I thought I'd show you a little bit around the place. This is my little cozy place outside, out front. <sighs> this is my little, my little getaway. Here you go. Yeah. There's Louie coming down the back stretch. <laughs> Yeah, this is where I like to sit out and leave when it's not too hot. Up there's my front porch. I wanted to take you in and show you. Oh yeah, I was just seeing Ringo Kitty for all y'all that's been asking about Ringo. See? He's doing really good now. Yeah, and he's laying down on the job, but he's doing good. Thanks for asking about him. A lot of people have been asking about my boy. This is inside our breezeway. And this is where a lot of uh, Oscar's Crocs are. This is where we get our, when we have our gatherings and stuff, where we come to get our supplies. We've got this big, long table everybody sits at. It's right off of outside there. You go out that door, I'll take you out there. It's where our fire pit and our other table and chairs is for outside. But, um, this is where we hang out for gatherings. Uh, he has Crocs. He collects. And he's got the half a gallon he also collects old yardsticks and rulers and old umbrellas. And here's um, some of his crocs. They go all the way up to 50 gallon, I'll show you here in a minute. Here's some of the little umbrellas. And some of these are teeny weeny umbrellas. Um, like little teeny old ladies would use back a long time ago. And um, we also use them to keep our supplies in. As you can see, I got paper towels there in that one. But he's got some really old umbrellas. Little dainty ones. Little antique ones. You open them up and they just about fall apart. They're so old. But he's got all kinds of stuff. Uh, he's got an old telephone. He's got one inside the house too. Um, he's got all kinds of stuff. He uh, collects uh, old yardsticks. Old yardsticks. He's got them from all over the place. But he's got all different kinds, all different lengths, all different kinds. He collects old canes. Here's some old canes, and there's some really cute ones of these. There's like a kitty cat playing with a, a spool of yarn. Uh, that one kind of creeps me out because it's a snake head. This one I said I needed. It's like the first GPS invented. <laughs> a walking stick. It has a compass on it. It really works, too. The compass really works. Um... He's just got all different kinds of old canes, old antique canes. And here's some big um, Crocs. That one's a 30. As you can see, it says the gallons on the Crocs. Like that one's 25. Uh, he has went everywhere getting stuff. He's went all the way to Minnesota? Wisconsin? No. Missouri. I don't know. One of them M states. <laughs> oh, let me show you my pork and beans. Get it? Pork and beans. <laughs> and here's turtle soup. <laughs> Isn't that cute? Uh, let's see. There's all different kinds of stuff out here. He's got all different kinds of crocs. He's got them stacked. He's got so many. Some of them are misprints where the tin and the emblem's upside down. Those are worth money too, I guess. Um, he's got, uh, look at me, I'm sweating. Did you see that sweat drip? Uh, he's got glass eggs and uh, plasticky eggs. There's a 20 gallon crock. There's a 20 gallon crock. There's a 12 gallon crock. Here is the 50 gallon crock. And let me tell you, that thing weighs a ton of pickling crock. 50 gallon. But this is just where. We come, when we have our cookouts and things, uh, people like to come out here. It's air conditioned and stuff. This is the middle between our garage and our home. It's connected. And uh, but anyway, you can see he's got all kinds. But anyway, when you come in the front door and you're walking through here, it's going to be hot out here, but I'm going to show you anyway. Then you come outside to our fire pit area. There's our back deck. Then you come out here to our back patio area. And uh, 
this is our fire pit and this is our table and chairs and things out here where we all hang out and have cookouts we've got two grills out here he also cooks on the fire uh, as you can see that uh, let me see if I can zoom in on that there we go see that round thing there well that as you can see is on a pulley thing and uh, anyway uh, he's got it fixed where you can swing that around over the fire and you can also raise it and lower it however close you want it to be to the fire he he made that so I thought that was pretty cool but it looks like my battery's getting low but up there's my goats I don't know if I can zoom in any closer on my goats or not I don't think I can but you can see them up there yeah you can see them a little bit <laughs> I don't think they're gonna have babies I think they're just fat but he might have say I'm no one to judge <laughs> But anyway, that's our little neck of the woods here. I just thought I'd show you these crocs and stuff. A lot of people like stuff like that. And uh, I just thought I'd show it to you. Um, anyway, it's a hot day out here today. And I just wanted to show you a little bit about... Oh, I'm zooming that camera around, Dana. Here, let me make that smaller. No wonder I can't see it. There you go. But this is where we kind of hang out. Just the things that we like and stuff. Looky there, who'd have thought those would have said live, laugh, and love, huh? <laughs> Wonder where that come from. <laughs> oh my goodness. But uh, I just thought you might like that. I just thought you might like looking at that and seeing where uh, where we are around here. Uh, I don't know how. Oh, here, there I am. See? Ha! <laughs> I am. I don't know how to turn this around. I don't know if I can or not. I guess I'd have to turn around this way, but then I can't really see. Well, I guess you are seeing me. Let me make it littler. No, littler. There, can you see me? Yeah, you can see me a little bit. <laughs> hey, I took my mom out today. We went shopping and stuff, and uh, I took her out and I spent some time with her and finally found her some clothes. She was having a hard time getting in her clothes, and Dad said, please take her and buy her some clothes for church and stuff, and so I did. It was not an easy job, but I did it. <laughs> the last store we went to, we finally hit a jackpot. So I was going through there just throwing clothes on my arm. I was carrying clothes everywhere. I'm like, you're getting this, 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 and this. <laughs> but we finally got her fixed up. I hope they all fit her. She didn't want to try them on, so I hope they fit. I said, if not, I've got the receipts, so I'll go back with you when you take them back. But uh, anyway... Uh, I just wanted to say hi, and I hope y'all are doing good, and have a great day, and I'll see you real soon. I have to do this on my uh, phone because my computer's in the shop, so I don't know how long it's going to take to upload this, but I'm going to try to do it. But I just think you all are wonderful, and thank you for subscribing. Give this a thumbs up, and uh, thank you to Lisa for my goodies that she sent me today. She's such a sweetheart, and uh, anyway, I hope y'all have a great day, and remember to live, love, laugh, and laugh some more. Because laughter's the best medicine. And I'll see y'all later. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh, my goodness. See ya.